Hello Internet. So this week went well, you know, it being Thanksgiving week and all. My favorite food during this this Thanksgiving season was fried potatoes. You gotta love home cooked food. So yeah, enough of that. I saw two things in the news that actually caught my attention and those are uh, North Korea bombs South Korea and Donald Trump is considering running for president. I'll save the best for last and start with Mr. Trump. So like I said, Donald Trump is considering running for president. At the moment, he has a website up called shoulddonaldtrumprun.com. And from what I saw, surprisingly, a lot of people want him to run. Now, the reason I say surprisingly is because, in my opinion, he's an ass. And some of you might be sitting here thinking, well, you have no right to judge Mr. Trump. You've never met him, so you don't know if he's that way in real life. <laughs> I wish that was true because sadly I have met Mr. Trump about 10 months ago on my uh, senior trip. Here's how the story goes. Me and my class were walking into the Trump Towers to go to the Nike store, which if you didn't know, there's a Nike store in the Trump Tower. And while we were walking in, uh, they were closing the doors. So we walked away. We were just walking toward the door, the exit door. And uh, we hear some girl scream at the top of her lungs. Oh my God, it's Mr. Trump! So we walk over to the ledge inside Mr. Trump's tower and uh, downstairs he's giving a speech and he's finishing his speech and headed toward the escalator. Here's a clip of what I was able to get. Do you know uh, that announcer was down there too? Dude, we can just go down the... Oh, no, no, no. no. What I didn't get to get with my camera still nauseates me just thinking about it. As he headed up toward the escalator, he actually rounded the corner and actually talked to one of my older coaches. And my older coach asked him if we could get a photo for our uh, school's yearbook. And he nodded his head and said, yeah. So we grouped together as quick as we could. But, I mean, as a businessman, I guess we weren't quick enough for him. And uh, he murmured and said we were taking too long and walked right through us and headed toward the Trump bar. So we all stood there stunned uh, as he was getting his drink. And my friend beside me screamed out the word douche in his direction. So, I mean, I guess I have the right to have a somewhat distorted viewpoint of Mr. Trump, but I'm not saying anything he is running for presidential-wise is wrong. It's just the way he treated us was wrong. As a businessman, he might be able to help out our country because, well, we need as much help as we can get right now. So, yeah, just let me know what you think about Mr. Trump running. Next thing I saw in the news was North Korea bombed South Korea. Yeah, I'm not going to try to pronounce that. island was bombed multiple times and actually killed two uh, Marine soldiers, two Korean Marine soldiers, that is, um, two civilians and injured multiple civilians. And at the moment, the USS George Washington is headed over there. And if y'all don't know, the USS George Washington is one of the largest supercarriers we have. So I guess you should join before you get drafted. I'm sure. If North Korea tries anything, we will destroy them. And I'll join just so I can say I was a part of it. So, my question to y'all is, if you are of drafting age, would you join the military? And if so, which branch would you choose? I would choose the Air Force just because I see more benefits there. Not that there's anything wrong with the other branches, it's just, that's my opinion. I'd want to be a cargo pilot or a loadmaster, but that's what I'd want to be. I'd probably end up being like a janitor on a supercarrier in the Indian Ocean somewhere. Not saying that there's anything wrong with those people. If you're watching my video, I'm just, I don't like boats. I get seasick. I like the air. I don't know why I don't get airsick, but I enjoy turbulence, so I'm not going to complain about it. So yeah, I'll get on to my week. This week I actually want a Coke shirt, and for y'all that don't know and or haven't seen my walls, uh, I would consider myself a little of a coke addict. There will be a link in the crotch bar if you want to see my uh, walls. Uh, you can check out my Deviant Art account and you can see my walls. Also, this week on Black Ops, I got to level 50 on Nazi Zombies. I dare you to beat me, and if you can, let me know. So yeah, that's my week. I hope you enjoyed. Also, just a little reminder, this Wednesday is December 1st. Um, and uh, of December 1st, I will be shaving my beard, unless one of you tell me not to, because I will be getting rid of all of it, unless one of y'all want to shaved a certain way. You gotta let me know. By Wednesday. You have no idea how much I'm gonna miss it. It's so fluffy. But most of you spoke and said get rid of the Wolverine look, so my wish is your command. I'm gonna feel so naked and whiter. So yeah, later YouTube.